Today I am going to watch the new and final Resident Evil. As you know, I'm kind of a big nerd and I like, I love video games. Resident Evil is one of my favorite series, so I thought it would make sense, even though I know a couple of the movies kind of weren't as good as, you know, the first one. Generally speaking, the video game movies are not that great, but it didn't feel right to not finish off Resident Evil franchise without seeing the last movie. We're just picking up tickets because apparently they don't have it in AVX or 3D or IMAX here anyways. And it's because I don't know why Fifty Shades needs AVX, but whatever. Hope Brian and his friend Benson is going to go grab some tickets, then we're gonna go have some food, and then we are gonna watch the movie, and hopefully the movie will be good. I will I will share my thoughts at the end of the movie. Hopefully it'll be good. And yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit. I went to see Resident Evil last night, the final chapter, and I just wanted to see it because I saw all the other ones and I just wanted to see how it ended. And I would have to say, oh, it didn't end good. It did not end good. I would really recommend watching it when it comes out on Netflix or, or whatever. Not something you would want to see in theaters. It was just, it was just way too action packed. It was, there's so much action, there wasn't a lot of story. <laughs> I mean, I can't imagine how much time and effort went into all those action scenes because it was just ridiculous, but it was just non-stop. It was really hard to pay attention because it was just action scene after action scene. And it was just, it was just too much. There was a couple times where like the volume would go really, really quiet and then there would be a jump scare. So there was a lot of jump scares and it got kind of, boring after the first half of the movie because you knew it was kind of gonna happen. I'm not entirely sure how they wrapped it up because I didn't think it was done well, but I mean it's done so hopefully they can reboot it and maybe make Resident Evil 7 as a movie or you know kind of stick to the characters that everyone knows and loves. But again my expectations weren't too high anyways because it is a video game movie. I just I was hoping that they would end it on a high note <laughs> which unfortunately they did not. with my friend from San Francisco, Sylvie, and Jing. We are going for dim sum. She's only here for a couple days, so she's been super busy, but she's made some time to come see me, so it's great. Oh, those are nice. <laughs> so let's go meet them. Today we are celebrating the fact that Josh is a Canadian citizen now officially. Yay! Okay. Say hi everybody. Hello. 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 Mom. Hi. 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 Hi.